Okay, we are going up Eastern Avenue in Springfield, Massachusetts. Eastern Avenue has got to be one of the most frightening streets I've ever gone down in this city. When people talk about downtown, but it's really the neighborhoods, the rundown neighborhoods that are the, uh, the more dangerous sections of the city. You go down Eastern Ave, and it's somewhat analogous to crossing Death Valley. You want to drive as fast as you can. You don't want to stop for anything. And you're just thankful that you got to the other side safely. Right. There's a lot of busted up houses here. A lot of broken windows, vacant buildings. There are some newer houses uh, towards the Mason Square area that came up. They look like townhouses. Here you can see coming in, there's a there's about three houses there, but there's an awful lot of busted up, broken down houses that really make this street look pretty scary. Okay, we are here on Hickory Street at the end of Eastern Avenue. And here we have the Waterfront Club. See, it's a very old building. Not very well kept. It looks like it hasn't been used in a while. But I get conflicting reports. Some people say it's used on the weekends, and another guy has said it's been closed. But I can see from down here, I don't know if the camera can really see, but there are footprints in the ice and snow. So it does look like some people have been in here. We're going to take a little walk around. Okay, uh, we're right on the back side here. You can see there's a couple of balconies on the back for looking out onto the water shop's pond. That's a good view, actually. There's a, a I don't know, satellite TV antenna or something, dish. But uh, that looks like it was quite the little uh, back area in its day. As you can see, also, we got a lot of busted up furniture along the side here. There's a uh, couple of mattresses. A love seat. Eh, we'll walk back up here. Okay, we're back at the front now. I just wanted to give you a shot of the side here. Again, a little love seat, chair there. And we have a ceiling fan. It still looks pretty good. Well, they dump it there. And we'll, we're going to walk along the uh, the brush line here. Oh, look at that. It's a little toy truck in there. It looks like a lot of incidental trash has just blown up against the bushes here. But you can look up here. There's also some bags. Those could have just brush in them. But somebody did decide to just dump them there. And we'll come around to the park. Okay, we're on the other side of the brush line. And as you can see, we have the Harriet Tubman Park Improvements section. This is actually pretty nice. There you go, a little play area for the kids. And there's uh, down there this picnic table, a couple of picnic tables for looking out on the shore. Boy, this, is, this could really be a nice spot. What a, what a nice view out onto the pond. I just want to come down here. I want to get a good shot of this old tree. There you go. Look at this thing, huh? That is a scary looking tree. Looks like one of those trees on the, the Lord of the Rings trilogy there. The Ents. It's an Ent. And here we have a little railway bridge. Okay, and there you have it. The Waterfront Club. Springfield, Massachusetts.